everybody welcome back to our channel today we are going to be doing the starter box of the Mel chemistry so these boxes are $44.90 a month Canadian um, they have free shipping and they come from the UK and they have a pretty good shipping service it gets here pretty quickly within like a week or two maybe once they uh, send out you notification that they're going to be shipping out your next box yeah So we do have a pile of uh, subscription boxes here that we have been saving up. We will be doing a video for each one of these separately. We're not going to do them all at the same time because that would just be crazy and insane. So we are going to be starting off with the starter box here, which is what, she, what they ship you um, for first time people so that you can get all the starter stuff. So just kind of give you a quick little sneak peek as to what's inside this box. So this is like everything that they put in the starter box here so you're yeah. going to have a lot of your supplies that you can reuse over time they do also give you a list um, usually on the back of things that you're going to need so they got a list of the stuff that you're going to need from the starter set and a list of the stuff or sorry they're going to have a list of the stuff that's coming in the, the uh, chemistry set for each box then a list of the stuff that you're going to need out of your starter box and then stuff that you're going to need to have on your own for these um, experiments. They do send about two to three experiments every month, which is kind of cool, for like $45 Canadian. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to go through and show you what's in our starter box. And then we're going to do the first set of chemistries, which is about tin. So we're going to make a tin hedgehog and a tin dendrite. So we're going to work on doing this, we're going to show you what's in our starter box, and yeah. then we're going to continue on and we're going to do other videos on the other ones that we've got here. Mm -hmm. Alright, so first up, we have a, a VR headset, <gasps> which isn't like an actual really big VR headset, mm -hmm. it works in conjunction with your phone. So you have this piece here with the glasses and you insert your phone in here somewhere yeah so you insert your phone in here like that and then you can kind of watch it I think this way no maybe I don't know if you like to flip it around like that oh yeah maybe watch it this way I don't know, but that's just really weird looking. It looks really blue. So that's the first thing. Yeah. And then there's the okay, big box. and we haven't opened these boxes yet, so we don't need like we know approximately what's coming in these boxes, but we haven't actually opened them to see the full scope of what's in them. Yeah. In that, this is still completely sealed from the factory. The seal is broken, people. The seal is broken. We're gonna go to jail. Ooh, okay, so here's the inside of that box. This is the starter box. There's more of the starter box. So we have a tray. And then we have a flask. We have oh, that's a glass. one of those. They send you a whole bunch of cups like this, little disposable cups. They give you a beaker, and then they give you like a plastic measuring cup. Uh, they give you two pairs of safety goggles, one for the child and one for the parent because safety first, everybody. <coughs> and this is the burner, I believe. Pretty that's, sure what that, what that is. That's so cute. I think you put it down like this. Let me see if I can. So yeah, you put it down like this and then you put your stuff on top of that. And we got a little mini funnel. Yeah. This is a magnifying glass that you can put onto 
the um, camera portion of your screen so that it will um, heighten everything. Oh wait, I just took the whole thing off. I didn't just take the cap off. There we go. So there we go. There's the magnifying screen there, or the magnifier, and then it's got a little cap that goes on it to keep it safe. We have this. Oh, this is for your phone, so you can balance your phone in it while you're recording. It's like your own little phone stand. We have a, a coaster. I'm sure we'll find out what that is for. This is for the top, so that, I'm pretty sure that sits in somewhere, maybe. And then you have different stoppers. Ooh. So you have one with no holes in it, one with one hole in it, depending on how fast or slow, and then you got one with two holes in it, so if you want for it to pour out a little bit faster, you can use the two holes. So that is everything that came in our starter set there. So we'll just put some of this stuff back. All right, so let's see what we're going to need for the first one, for the first experiment. Okay. Okay, so we'll just open that up. Okay, so it says that we are going to need the plastic tray, safety goggles, the smartphone clip-on macro lens for this experiment. Chemistry said it's going to contain liquid soap, sodium hydrogen sulfate, tin chloride, zinc, a petri dish, a battery holder, bottle cap, bottle nozzle, crocodile clip wire, or crocodile clip wire, paper clip, pin opener, Plastic vial, protective gloves, an experiment card with instructions. Done. So this is what we're going to be making. We just showed you that. So we're just going to move this stuff to the side. And these are really small. So here's the front of the box. Okay, so here is everything. As in the box, it kind of gives you a diagram of how to set stuff up for it. Let's see if I can get right in there. Oh my goodness, okay. Okay, so it gives you a diagram of how you're going to set things up for it. Here are the instruction cards that it comes with. So which one would you like to make first, though? Um, tin head chop. All right. So this is supposed to be a real easy one. So there's the instructions on the inside oh there. So Miss Bell can read those instructions. All right, and we got little safety tips in there. And then, little tips that go into yeah, the Yeah, and then you have to insert the tip securely. All right. There we go. Okay, so we're just gonna. Oh. I get tips on it. And that's where those pieces were. Uh -huh. <coughs> and I'm gonna need help us out with a red cap. There we go. So there's that. Okay. Put that back on there. Stick the tip in there. Make sure that it's on there securely. And then you need to put that. And then you have to shake it. Okay, well, your experiment, so you do. Okay. So they also come with. A small size of gloves and a large set of size of gloves. So Belle, there's your gloves. There you go. Where's that thing that I have to fill on? I think it's oh. 
right, so what's your next step? So number two. I have to fill this halfway. Mm, are you sure? Yeah, so it's over there. Oh, okay. Okay, so you got to fill up oh. one of those oh. halfway. Okay. Wait. So I filled it up halfway and Okay, this one says now submerge a piece of more active metal, zinc into the tin salt solution. Where is the So metals in their metallic form are made of positively charged particles embedded in negatively charged cloud of electrons. The particles of some metals like to reside inside such a cloud more than others. In our experiment, tin would rather chill inside a cloud of electrons, whereas zinc is relatively more inclined to float on its own as a charged particle. Nope, just leave it. Well, you can kind of see it. Yeah. A little bit. Not very much. Mm -hmm. Ow. Well, it's doing a little bit more now. See, it's kind of spiking up. Oh, yeah, looking like a. Oh, these are tight. So it is starting to spike up a little bit. And all these different. Okay. A metal tree grows right here. Okay, so we basically have to do the same thing again, but then we put one bottle and then liquid soap. Two drops. Mm. Alright, so we got our liquid soap. Oh, hold on. Uh, and then we need. Red and green one. Is that green? Yeah, it's green. That's green. Oh, yeah, they're all red and green, though. Okay. Oh. Well, it's kind of hedgehogging. I mean, it's getting a little spiky. Yeah. Oh, my God. What are those? I think they're just absorbent seeds. Like oh, in case it spills. spills. Oh. Something in the cap. Yeah, you're supposed to poke it down with this.
That would have been bad. Oh, this Did you already get those? Yeah, that needs four. Okay. And I got the other side. Okay. Next, we're going to make a green. I know. Okay. Okay, so next we're going to put in the whole bottle. That's so cool. Okay, so that's it for the bottle. Next, we are going to need, where did it go? Liquid soap. And we're going to add in two drops of that. Where's the thing to push down with or anything? So I think that's everything for this video. Yep. Maybe some of the other ones will be a little bit more exciting than these ones were. Yeah, sorry about that. It's still pretty neat to try out anyways mm -hmm. that's everything for us for today for this box we'll see you guys on the next one bye, bye.